Hello and welcome to the Skating Lesson. I'm Jennifer Kirk. This is Dave Lees. We are both in Minneapolis, Minnesota. The Junior Men's Rock Program is going on right now and we're going to discuss Paulina Edmonds' long program practice today. I was not here, I was in the mm -hmm. air, but you are here, Dave. Sure. Tell us about it. All right, so Paulina skated later on in the group. I believe she was second uh, to last in the order. The one thing, Paulina took a long time to warm up. Uh, she didn't do many jumps. I think uh, other was already doing their combinations and Paulina was still doing singles, a lot of stroking. Her movements look bigger to me. They look more refined and more mature. Oh, still the hands. <laughs> Hands? Oh, the, hands, the limp hands. Huh? Not maybe as you would like. Um, she looked like she was wearing an Ali Raisman leotard. Again, she kind of blended into the ice a bit. The white against white didn't stand out in the practice ice. I just thought that her body language, she looks solid here, but she didn't look to be working too hard. She's definitely not going overextending on the ice. I know Megan Duhamel couldn't believe Gracie was doing a full long, but Frank has his skaters do full longs. Some people don't like that at events. You know, Megan says the top skaters don't do that. You know, I mean, she does have a world <laughs> title. I know, I'm just saying, I'm not going to sass with Jillian, but I think it's good on right. the Wednesday. Like, you're not going to do your long until Saturday. You should probably do a long run through, yeah. in my opinion. So Paulina, I know, and I watched her at Boston Nationals. It's very customary for her not to do any jumps. And we saw that at Skate Canada, she doesn't do the jumps in the program. But there weren't a lot of jumps outside of the program. Flip half loop sow. The sow to me looked under I was today. Say, how did the rotation? To look? me, it, the, un, the sow looked under. Um, the Lutz toe looked good when she did do it, but we didn't see it in the program. So we, not a lot that Paulina really did in practice today. She looks fit. She looks ready uh, to go in isolation. But again, it's hard to know without the yeah. stamina and how are those rotations going to be. I think the thing about her, though, is she's such a competitor that she's mm -hmm. somebody that I never worry that she's not going to put it together. I think she mm -hmm. does train at home. So for her, it comes out to really, in my opinion, how the judges are going to score her. Mm -hmm. um, and maybe it's smart for her not to be doing a bunch of jumps in practice because she doesn't want to leave any room. Yeah, and it's funny, I was talking to a coach today and she said with Paulina, it's do they want to see those under rotations or not? Do they want her on the world team in Boston? And that could be the difference here. And it, you know what, there are a lot of choices for that third spot. It could get political.